Hey, good morning, Auburn parents, guardians, and Auburn students. Uh, got a message for you. It's September 29th today. Um, I'm sure most of you are aware of this thing called the TikTok challenge. Um, our school's been hit hard by it. Um, we've had a lot of vandalism in our boys, uh, two of our restrooms. We've had mirrors torn off walls. We've had, you know, soap dispensers where the soap's been stolen. Dispensers have been vandalized. We've had plumbing on sinks torn out. Um, all because of a cheap thrill of something called the TikTok challenge. Um, of course, when the students do make the TikToks, their faces aren't in it. And, you know, there's a lot of privacy um, allowed in restrooms. And this is kind of a national phenomenon, I guess. It's going on all over the place. First, we thought it was kind of here in this region. And uh, it's real. It's, it's happening. And whoever did kind of push out this TikTok challenge originally, has actually broken it down month to month to month. So that kind of gives me a little bit of concern because some of the upcoming months, uh, some of the things, although they're not of a vandalism type of a uh, challenge, it's it's some pretty poor behavior. Uh, one of them is hitting a staff member. Another one would be uh, kissing your friend's girlfriend, um, which could cause a lot of issues. Another one is jabbing a female's breast. Um, messing up school signs, uh, flipping off the front office, spray painting neighbors' fences. So these are just some of the things that kids are being encouraged to do. When I say kids, I mean, this is happening at college campuses too. So what I'm asking parents to do, all parents, even though we know this is a small percentage of our students, um, we've got 1,750 students and the TikTok challenge in the restroom, we're pretty much sure it's down to about maybe five or six students. Um, but we don't know that either. That's our best guesstimate. I guess I just want to say that predominantly all of our kids show up and they do a good job at school. I just know when I was younger, it was easier to get sucked into things. And, you know, technology makes it even one more layer of challenge for us adults. So please have a conversation with your kids um, about doing TikToks, about doing anything resembling anything from the TikTok challenge. And, and we won't have to, you know, um, have that kind of component in any of their lives. I've been talking to some of our kids who've gotten in trouble about making sure you have a clean lane in front of you as you work through your education. School's hard enough, but to be adding things like this or getting into, you know, confrontations at school, that just makes the traveling and the journey that much tougher. And, you know, when the kids have kind of thought about it sensibly, they get it, they understand, but I really need your help in talking to them about conflicts and then also getting sucked into this TikTok challenge thing. It's real, it's here, um, and we need your help. So thank you very much. If you have some great ideas or just some brainstorms and you want to email them to me, by all means. All right, have a great weekend. Thank you.